I, I, I built this wall but it, it was upside down it didn't quite work and then I built it again and it just fell over so I built it a third time which was good until it spontaneously caught fire which I don't think was what people really intended Just in case anyone was under the delusion that reality was going to rear its ugly head in this game No No chance Look at Wendymon, our one-armed huntress, carpenter, smart Alec, still using her bow. How odd. Right, as much as I want that, when uh, Haley, I need you to get back down here. Go back here again, okay, and Wendy and Shizzy... Need you back at work. Let's get up here as well. Where's that rhino? There it is. Needs okay, so what we'll do is we'll use Haley to kite it, and uh, Wendy can shoot at it. Shizzy It'll just be there to look pretty at this point, I think. Okay, all right. At least Wendy's the one with a good weapon. Look, she's getting married. Well, actually, they're not getting married yet, are they? They're just uh, in a relationship. But still, come on. Here he comes. Oh, no. Here he comes. That's it, get closer. Okay, so it's going to take you a little while to kill, I think. Alright, so... Ah, oh, excellent, you're attacking Shizzy now, that's exactly what I want. Let's make sure... Oh, you're attacking Wendy now, alright. Uh, not the best thing because that means that Wendy's going to get a little bit wounded oh come on stop switching targets how is Wendy using that bow one handed oh this is no good ok right pile in See if we can take the aggro. Ah, oh, there we go. Right, marvellous. And the nice thing is that's going to be a load of food for us. Right. I'll draft you guys. Shizzy, let's get this hauled. Wendy, go and sort yourself out. Hayley, what's your health? Bruises and cracks, that's not a problem. Shizzy. You're alright, Wendy. Scratches. Okay, that's actually a lot of uh, scratches, so let's get you some medical attention, shall we? Um, make that one medical for now. Wendy. There we go, you're resting till healed. Right. Hayley, what are you up to? Eating a meal. Okay, that's good. Right. 
So that meat and the lack of veg means we're pretty much out of our pemmican making stage. But we will be making simple meals out of that. Should keep us going for a few more days. Uh, uh, so we're almost into winter now. And we have 15, 20, 25. So we're probably going to go about 30 days now before the next... Uh, uh, the next harvest. Uh, so I don't think we've got enough pemmican. I think we've got a good start. But... We're going to definitely need to go hunting during the winter. And when the hunting runs out, we'll start using the pemmican. There we go. That's everybody treated. Let's take that off medical. Let's sleep somewhere. There we go. healed that's good looks like the snow is starting to thaw we really need to do something about you right I think it's time to start getting rid of the last of this stuff out of here so Allow all that, let it be moved. And Wendy, what are you doing at the moment? You're digging. The roof. Oh, we nearly got that done. Okay, well, I think you can haul some stuff for me. Let's get this stuff all hauled up. Oh yes, you can't for you can't haul full loads anymore, can you? Though you can still use a bow. Something I, I, I presume you're hauling it with your toes or something like that. It's it's the only the only explanation that makes sense. <laughs> you're getting there somehow. All right, come on. Keep on hauling this pemmican. There we go. No, no more digging granite for you. Let's get this all hauled up. The rest of the stuff down here I'm not all that worried about, to be totally honest with you. But... Yeah, this pemmican... It's going to get us through the winter. Oh, it's very important to us. Let's see, 750. Yeah, we've got about 800 pieces of pemmican, which, yeah, all of a sudden I'm, I'm fairly relaxed about the food situation because this is going to last us. Uh, which is a good thing. Digging a granite, you know. That's what you think. Uh, four more runs. We'll have to find a mod that will give us a wheelbarrow. Actually, thinking about it, health. Peg legs, peg legs, denture, and harvesting. Okay, I cannot. Well, I didn't think there was going to be. But it would be nice to give her a hook. Okay, when do you take care of yourself? Come on, recruit. Don't hold the whole deer hide. Hold the pemmican. Good, that's actually starting to look nice and full now. Right, let's get the last of this pemmican hauled. And the rest of the stuff can get hauled up as and when. There we go, brilliant, okay. And 
and we'll forbid all that pemmican for now. There, when you look at it like that, 868, I think somebody's eaten some of it to be honest with you. It starts looking good, okay. What's this, what do we think about this room? No, that's the wrong one. That's what I want. Dull, mediocre, but it's spacious. It's ugly and it's very dirty. Okay, right. right. What can we do to neaten this up a little bit? Uh, so first of all, let's get rid of that. What's a poor dining chair give us in terms of beauty? Right, that does give us some beauty. Shoddy one. Hardly any at all. Okay, so yes, we could improve this area considerably by improving these chairs and tables and things like that. Yeah, this is much more beauty. So let's do that. Uh, um, furniture, dining chairs. Seven, eight, nine. Get some of those built. Um, good work, Wendy. Let's get save tables built. I think let's experiment into armchairs. How are we doing for material? So we've got loads of deer hide, we've got loads of rhino hide, and we've got a bit of muffalo leather. So, okay. Let's make some deer hide armchairs. Not enough. Okay, right, we'll do that later on. But let's get that stuff built. We're out of medicine. We're actually out of medicine now. That's all being moved up. That's brilliant. So need to tidy this place up a bit. Yeah, a normal chair, that's brilliant, that's a good start. Haley, what are you doing? Um, you're doing a lot of hauling. I suppose we've got a lot of hauling to do. Yep, yeah, let's leave you doing that for now. Um, do you know what? I've immediately changed my mind. As you're just doing hauling, we cannot prioritize research. Oh no. Okay, right. As we're getting later in the year, as we have other people to do hauling, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make these less important for you. We'll put that back later on. But there we go. Now you're researching. And we'll have clothes out of you, and then we will have stone cutting. What you think of that? All those. As soon as we get stone cutting done, I can start doing some building. I want to build some defences up here, and start getting these houses done. I think replace this wall with stone as well. But that, that can happen later on. So Shizzy wasn't cooking because the stove wasn't full. And as a result, was eating raw meat. Okay, nothing negative about it at this point. Uh, quick, simple meal. Right, we don't have any simple meals. Right, what's going wrong here? So that's a vegetarian, and this one, uh, that was vegetarian. 
That looks vegetarian. That explains the problem. Right, we'll take that one off. We'll put on meat, but it, just in case, let's take off human meat and let's take off insect meat. There we go. And now Shizzy should actually cook. There we go, good. We have enough for, uh, I think, a few days worth of food there. Uh, what's the temperature like in there? Mm. It's gone above freezing now, but so let's uh, turn it off. Get somebody close that door. Get that hauled. Get that hauled as well. There we go. Okay, that's that's good for food production back to normal. Actually, while I'm thinking about it, uh, zones, stockpile zone. Right. So what we do is create a stockpile zone there, and it'll only store meals. So we clear all. Make this one critical. Four meals there. Yeah, that looks about right. Okay, and now we can we'll copy those settings and we'll create some more zones. We'll create uh, a stockpile zone here and. Place the settings in there, and we'll do exactly the same thing over these bottom chairs as well. So one more stockpile zone, and paste the settings, and then we'll come in here, and we'll remove meals from there. Then what they will do is they'll start storing the the, the meals by the chairs, and the people just come in and sit down, and away they go. Okay. And out of wood, there's still loads to be hauled. That should be alright, but let's get some more cut anyway. There we go. Just keep them going. How's our research going? Our research is not going. Oh, Haley Rounds had enough of the day. Right, let's have a quick look at our prisoners. So he's a little bit stressed, but not too bad. Um, feeling great. Repulsive prison cell. Yes, it is horrible, isn't it? Cramped environment, imprisoned, hideous environment. Not helping us much. We should try to work on these, these prison cells, but it would just be so much easier if you guys would just... Um, you know, join the team, become part of the clan, whatever you want to call it. Just do it. Okay, let's add some. Let's add some joy. I don't know if this is needed, but let's add a, a, a pin there. And I think actually while we're at it, structure. Put that wall in there, and once we've done that, we'll take out that wall there. That's going to give Trogo a bit more space, which might cheer him up a little bit. To that okay, loads more trees coming down. We've got loads of wood floating around, and we just need to get it hauled. Unfortunately, one of our haulers is now doing solid research, but we need that research done. Winter is coming, oh, two days away from winter, and I want to do a lot of building over winter. So, how are these looking? Oh, superior chair, excellent. A shoddy chair that can be just deconstructed, a normal chair that's good. An awful chair that could be decent structure. There we go. So we get some better chairs out of this. It's a good start, I think. 